In this video, I'm going to show you how you can apply a gradient fill color to the background of an element in WebStarts. Here you can see that I've applied a background gradient that goes from hot pink to neon blue. Let me show you how I did that. In WebStarts, gradient fill colors can be applied to shapes. That means either boxes, strips, or even circles. But for this demo, I'm going to show you how to change the background fill color for a strip. So I begin by selecting the strip. You can tell that the strip is selected by the blue outline. Next, click on the color fill bucket, then click background color, and scroll to the bottom of your color palette. There you'll see a selection of gradients. You can apply any of these gradients by simply clicking on it. You can create your own custom gradient by clicking the plus icon and then choosing through some recommended gradients or you can customize those recommended gradients by clicking on the color palette, choosing a new color, and you can even add a color by clicking the add icon. You can change the direction of a gradient by clicking the direction arrow. So for example, I took that gradient from vertical to horizontal. By continuing to click the direction arrow, I can flip the direction of the gradient. When you're ready to apply the gradient, just click apply. Any gradient that you apply will be automatically saved to your gradient color palette. I'm just going to return to my original gradient because it's the one I like. So I click on it and it's applied. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching and don't forget to visit webstarts.com to create your very own free website and see more helpful videos like this.